Good morning. Welcome, Team Southside, where teamwork makes the dream work. Ms. Reynolds here. And Ms. D. And we hope you're having a fabulous Wednesday so far. Let's go ahead and stand up and say the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, well, we have officially made it halfway through our amazing week, it and it has, has been, been such a good one so far. And going right along with all of the super awesome things that we've seen here at Southside this week is our word of the week. And our word of the week is camaraderie. And Mr. Reynolds, what does it mean when you show camaraderie? Well, camaraderie is something that actually you form when you go through things together in a group. So it's like a togetherness, it's like a, um, a sense of belonging. Right. So uh, yeah, camaraderie. Yeah. And hopefully you're, you're getting that with your house. The other people in your house, in your grade level, that's part of camaraderie. And it has been amazing to see that camaraderie grow and blossom even just the past couple of days. So we are so excited about that. So yesterday, we talked about some synonyms or words that mean something similar to the word camaraderie. And today we're going to be talking about some antonyms of the word camaraderie. And so a synonym is a word that means the same, but an antonym is a word that means the opposite. opposite. So right. keep that in mind. So one word that I think of when I think of the opposite of camaraderie is the word exclude which is also kind of a big word too, but when you exclude someone, you basically are pushing them away and not letting them join your group. So that would be the total opposite of what we want for camaraderie. Yeah, and maybe if you don't have camaraderie, you might also have some loneliness because you're doing yes. things by yourself. Maybe isolation. Or isolate, that's right. Yes, so you might just feel like by yourself and not like you're part of a team and like you don't belong. And so those are words that mean the opposite. And those are all things that we are trying to stay away, away from when we're building this camaraderie. And that is why we are so excited about watching you guys join these houses because you immediately have this sense of camaraderie and sense of belonging. And it has been so awesome to see. And on Friday, you're gonna have an opportunity to show even more camaraderie, get closer with those people in your house because we're gonna have our very first school-wide house party. Oh, I cannot wait. So we are having a rally with the entire school and you get to see everybody in your house on Friday, which means since we're getting everyone together and since we're going to be in our houses celebrating the camaraderie, we need to represent. That's right. You need to wear either your house shirt that you've gotten in the last little bit or something the color of your house. That's right. So we cannot wait to see you guys all decked out representing your new house on Friday that is happening. So when you are planning out your week, don't forget Friday we have our first house rally and we are so excited. You know, Friday is a busy day. It because is. even after we have the house rally, we have our back to school color run, 5K, and they're even throwing in the little foam this year. So you can run through the foam too if you want. And so it is going to be a blast. I'm looking so forward to it. We have so many things to look forward to. So six o'clock on Friday, the fun continues. So make sure you make a plan to come join us. I think the weather is going to be really nice. And of course, we are all about having a fun time. So join us on Friday night for the color run. All right, well, as the week continues, you guys know that iReady is continuing as well. So amidst all the excitement, don't forget when you are taking your iReady test, make sure you stay focused, do your very best. When you're in the hallway, stay nice and quiet and respect for all the students that are working so hard on their very first diagnostic. And you guys have done a really, really good job at that. And second graders. Ooh, today, today sure is day. the day. And then first grade you got tomorrow. Yes. So we're almost there. So second graders, we're so excited to get you guys sorted into your house today. And first graders, your day is tomorrow. And we cannot wait to see the camaraderie continue to build. All right, you guys. Well, you know we love to see you be safe, safe respectful, respectful, and responsible. And it's, it's always a great, great day, day to be a Southside Stallion. Stallion. Bye, y'all.